Hey guys, welcome back. I wanted to share with you a couple um, more of the dies that I've been playing with for um, Scrap Diva Designs. This is part of the October release. Here is Erica's website, and there is all the social info. So, let me show you real quick. The first one I played with is Pumpkin Mini Album number two. So, we've got um, all the different layering pieces, um, your outline, and then your um, next stitched layering piece, and then you got this more, um, you know, detailed piece here, and then it also comes with these, so you can um, add the stem if you want, and these cute little you know, uh, swirly things, vines, I guess you would call them. And then it's got a, you can make it a jack lantern if you want, and with this um, mouth, and then you got a little triangle nose, and then you got two little spiders for eyes. So, so cute. So that's the first one I played with. Came together super fast and easy. So this is how it turned out. It's super cute. I have all of these white um, glitter foam, uh, just white glitter pieces up on foam. And so I have my little eyes here, and then I use some of these cute little um, things I've had in my stash forever pebbles on um, these cute little eyeballs. They're puppy stickers. So I decided um, to add those in the center. So it just kind of looks like the pupil, you know, of the eye. So I thought that turned out pretty cute. This is a piece of you know, like, um, what do you call it? Confetti stuff, I just put that there, boo. Here's a bat I had in my stash. And then a bow that I was gifted, I added that on top. Some cute little black eyelash trim. And then I put a little puffy sticker pumpkin in the middle. And I have all three layers layered up there. And I made mine into a card. So there we go, it flips up, and then there's my back. I just have my name on it. So I think it turned out really cute. So we got a cute little card I could gift somebody. So I made that with that one. And then the next one I played with is called Memory Dex Pocket Set. So here is the dies. Okay, so, um, these are just all the pieces to build it. It's super easy. Um, lots of layering pieces, so you can layer everything up if you want to. So this is how my turned out. So we've got the cute little memory decks here. So it's kind of just like a square piece and with a layering piece. Okay. And then this part's your box, which you um, put together and then just, you know, mount it on top of that. Um, I put a Velcro piece for mine together and that's the inside. I went ahead and layered all the inside stuff too. So it's all nice and finished so I can put some nice little things down in there. And then I used um, just a piece of the spider web die that I had cut from something else from the spider spider web mini album from last month I believe it was. And so I just I cut it up, things up a lot of times and just stick things in so that's a, just a piece of that. It was it's out of pink glitter. Okay, and then um, I used another die here, which is called the double layer rosette. Okay, and so um, I made this one. This is out of the thin one, and it's only one strip. And I like, I love the way that looks. Um, so that's what I did again. I made some before, and then I took the layering piece and I put it underneath, and I don't know, it just kind of makes it look like, more, I don't know, like a flower, I guess, more. Um, I just like the looks of it, or like a star burst of, you know, something like that. And that I just like that look, so I did, I did that again. And then I used the spider from um, this set also, from the pumpkin mini album too. So there's a spider cut out of pink glitter, and I mounted him on foam up there on the top. And then I just used one of these um, cute little ghosties from the um, Halloween 
stamp and die set from last month so i just colored it in a tad with my copics <laughs> all i had to really do was the bow and i just kind of did an outline around the ghost because it was you know of course already white um i had um embossed the outline with a silver embossing powder so that was already there okay and then i just attached some cute little tassels and beads and stuff here to a garment pin and I just punched a hole with my crocodile there on the side and attached it like that. So I think it turned out really cute and I love the look of the um, double layer rosette. It's so cute and I've seen it done a bunch of different ways. So I've shared before the two that I made first off. Uh, let me see where are they so I could just show you in case you didn't see it what those look like so here's this is the first one I made I'm just out of plain paper so um, it kind of blends in instead of two different colors and again it's just you know layered up and some eyelash trim around and a cute little fabric star that I had so you, you can make it like this this is the small one again this is also the small one but this is um like i told you i when i did this one and this one i just used one strip i only cut one strip and put it together and that's what it makes it look like when you connect this out of one strip when you do true strips it looks like this this bottom layer right here much uh, thinner and closer together and then i did the um the layering piece on top but it's the same color so you know it doesn't stand out um, very much on this, but it gives it a really pretty look. I have tool in between the two layers, and then I have this stuff on top. So anyway, I've shared these before, but I just kind of wanted to give you a quick look at how they look, all the different looks that you can get. And if I would have did um, different color paper or pattern paper, this would have given it a total different look also. Same here. So anyway, lots of options. And this, I said, all these are the small. I haven't used the, the large one. So really nice but I think this turned out so cute and my cute little card so love that and this will be great for swaps I'm really looking forward to that so anyway thank you so much for watching I will link Erica's shop I will list my discount code if you decide to um, pick up anything if you use my discount code or my um, affiliate links it will um, give me a small portion of the sale so and it doesn't cost you anymore um, thank you, by the way, to all those who, who do use it. I really appreciate that. And then I will li uh, link all my, you know, all the dies that I use. Okay, thank you so much for watching. See you on the next one. Bye.